Yeah, hi there. I just wanted to do, to do this quick little video, even though I'm extremely tired. I had a very, oh, I don't know, trying day, I guess you could say, or scary even, or yeah, uh, I'll get to that in a minute. But anyway, I just wanted to do this little video because I wanted to thank my um, YouTube subscribers. There was a few of them that did end up sending me um, a few donations. There was a few for that were $20 and I want to thank you for those. And there was another for five. I want to thank you also. So yeah, I will put the donation link below as usually. And so it's getting close to, oh, I don't know, holidays, I guess, Thanksgiving. And there's a lot of uh, traffic on the road. So just everyone should be aware and careful and don't do what I almost did today, which was I almost ran a cop over. And you might say, how in the hell do you do that? Well, let me tell you, if you're driving on the freeway or highway and you have a large truck in front of you, like I did, okay, and you know how they drive slow, and you know how you can't see around them because they're so big and you're trying to see your exit, right? And you know it's coming up, but you can't see around them enough to know if there's something in the way. So I knew my exit was coming up. I started to veer over as I knew my exit was coming up. And sure enough, there had been, there was this motorcycle cop. He was walking kind of out on the street as the exit ramp goes, starts to go, there was, he pulled over someone. And I saw him just as I was starting to go over. Now, if it would have been, oh, I don't know, dark out or, oh, I don't know, overcast, maybe cloudy or something, I don't know. There's a good chance I wouldn't have saw that cop and I could have almost hit him. Like I almost, went off but i ended up swerving back onto the freeway and i actually missed my turn thanks to that dumb cop why do they do that why why do they pull people people over on highways anyway and especially near an off-ramp that's like the most dangerous place you can pull over is near an off-ramp because there are people getting ready to go off the off-ramp and if there's a large semi like i had in front of me which always happens to me i don't know why that is why why is it every single time i really really need to see the off-ramp i always have a huge truck in front of me it happens all the time so yeah i swerved back over and i missed my turn so I had to go the wrong way. I ended up going the other, the wrong way. And I was on my way to, to a client, but I'm just really, really lucky that there was an exit. As soon as I went the wrong way, I could, I immediately got off and did a U-turn and got back on the freeway going the other or the off ramp going the other way. So I took the off ramp going the wrong way. So I got back on and then got off the next off ramp going the right way. So yeah, well, I don't have much to report on my client. He was just a nice older 60 year old something gentleman, a little heavy weight, um, didn't get much action in the bedroom and his wife was at work. So yeah, when the mice are away, the cats will play. Is that, or is it, no, it's the other way around. That's right. When the cat's away, the mice will play. Okay. Okay. So not much to report with that. It was simple, easy, quick. He was generous and very nice. And again, Thank you for your don donations. I want to keep doing videos and I know YouTube is really cracking down hard and they've already cracked down on, oh, I don't know, I guess you could say adult content stuff, but isn't YouTube for adults? I guess not. I never know what I can say or what I can't say because they don't tell you. And now they're going to get ready to crack down on family stuff or kid stuff. So go figure. I guess they're going to be the next to go through the ad apocalypse or something. Who knows? But yeah, I really appreciate the donations and I want to keep doing videos. So keep sending those donations and maybe I'll make it a little juicier next time. We'll see. Take care.